Hey guys, in this video I want to show you how to install the Galaxy S4's Ender 6.0 Marshmallow ROM um, that is available, so download it first from the link down below in the description box and make sure you have root and the custom recovery installed. Now when you have those two things, uh, then you have the access, you have the right to download a ROM, then copy the ROM to your internal memory of your phone, internal memory of your phone, to the root of your storage, and then boot up into your recovery mode by holding down the power volume up and the home key at the same time. So as you can see, I am actually in my recovery. So I'm using TWRP. Uh, this is version 2.8.3.0. Works absolutely fine. I had no problem. So first off, uh, no matter what software you are currently uh, running no matter what rom you're currently running even if it's a custom rom or a or, or a stock based custom rom or even a stock rom with root uh, first you have to go uh, first you have to make a backup after making a backup you need to go back and then first go into wipe uh, then do this swipe to factory data reset and it will take some few seconds and then it will be done and you will be here again now after doing the vibe data factory reset you need to go to install now this is my internal memory all my folders and all that so like i said you need to copy it to the root of your storage so i got the rom here is called as aosp 6.0 uh, jflde that's for the i9505 so if you have to click that and then swipe to confirm flash it will take one two minutes and then go back like this and then reboot into system now with this ROM you will also going to get root uh, the super SU app so uh, which basically which I haven't seen with other phones when I installed the marshmallow so yeah it's on under marshmallow 6.0 plus root for your Galaxy S4. So I'm just gonna show you that this actually works. This is like a fully working 6.0 Marshmallow ROM for our beloved Galaxy S4 uh, that you can install right now. And obviously this is like a first first ROM, so probably it will when you have some issues. Well, I haven't seen some issues. Uh, just one is that it doesn't let me download some stuff from browser it just crashes so I haven't tried out Google Chrome or or other browsers so maybe they work but this is how it looks like I'm just gonna quickly show you in the settings scroll down to about phone and this is 6.0 marshmallow so going again into if you tap here this is how it looks like so yeah this is 6.0 marshmallow for our Galaxy S4 uh, this is no joke. This is a custom ROM, so this is not from Samsung. This is a custom ROM from a developer. So links will be in the description box. So make sure you download the ROM first, copy it to your internal SD card, internal memory, no SD card, just internal memory, and it, and of course. Uh, if you are going to install this ROM, you should try out without SD card because SD card can cause the boot loop. Um, can cause, you know, it's just a possibility so it might work with the SD card I know I don't have the SD card on in my note uh, in my S4 so yeah just download the ROM copy it into your internal storage go into the recovery do a vibe data factory and then just boom flash the ROM and make sure you make a backup first if anything goes wrong you can always go back to your backup so yeah backup is important so that's that if you have any questions comment below and I'll see you guys in my next one peace out